Okay, chat GPT. Let's try this. New chat and I want you to act as a YouTuber and write an opening hook for a video about using chat GPT in video marketing. The hook should use chat GPT in the concept and enter. All right, let's give it a go. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to talk about a revolutionary way to up your video marketing game. And it all starts with one powerful tool, ChatGPT. That's right, you heard it correctly. ChatGPT is not just a language model that can answer your questions, but it can also help you create engaging video content that your audience will love. So if you're ready to take your video marketing to the next level, then keep watching, because this video is going to be a game changer for you. It's not bad. Let's try something else. <laughs> Great. Please rewrite this YouTube hook in the style of Mr. Beast. All right, <laughs> here we go. What's going on guys? It's your boy, Mr. Beast. And today I'm bringing you something mind blowing. I'm talking about a tool that's going to change the way that you do video marketing forever. That's right, I'm talking about ChatGPT, the ultimate weapon in your video marketing arsenal. With ChatGPT, you can create videos that are so engaging, your viewers won't be able to look away. So if you're ready to blow your competition out of the water, then strap in, because this video is going to be epic. <laughs> Bit over the top, let's try something else. Okay, now, please write the hook in the style of Ben Amos from Engage Video Marketing. Here we go. G'day guys, it's Ben from Engage Video Marketing and today I'm excited to share with you a secret weapon that's going to supercharge your video marketing strategy. And that weapon is none other than ChatGPT. This innovative tool is going to take your video content creation to the next level and help you engage with your audience like never before. So if you're looking to create video content that really resonates with your audience and drives results, then stick around because you don't wanna miss this. Now that's pretty good. G'day and welcome back to the Engage Video Marketing Podcast. This is episode 268. And if you haven't yet heard of the AI tool that's been taking the online world by storm over the last couple of months, then keep watching and keep listening because in this episode, I'm sharing my thoughts on ChatGPT for video strategy. And to be honest, I've been blown away from what this tool and other artificial intelligence tools mean for our industry. So I'm excited to dive in. Before we get into some specific use cases for AI in video strategy, I first wanna share with you exactly what is ChatGPT and why it's something to pay attention to as a video strategist. You see, ChatGPT is an, an advanced language model created by a company called OpenAI. It's basically a chat window that's connected to a super powerful artificial intelligence model that is capable of generating human-like responses to various prompts and questions. It uses deep learning algorithms to understand and analyze language patterns and can generate text that is both coherent and contextually relevant. In fact, ChatGPT helped me write that explanation too. So as a tool for video strategy, ChatGPT can be extremely useful for content creators and marketers who want to improve the quality and engagement of their video content. You see, with tools like ChatGPT, you can generate video scripts, you can generate captions and, and titles that are optimized for your target audience using language and keywords that are proven to drive engagement and conversions. ChatGPT can also be used to generate ideas for video content, can help you come up with fresh and creative concepts that resonate with your target audience. And because it can generate text in just a matter of seconds, ChatGPT can help you save time and effort in creating video content, allowing you to focus on other aspects of your video strategy. So I've been playing around with ChatGPT over the last month or two, and I wanna share with you some specific ways that I see tools such as this one helping us with our video marketing, either for our own business or for our clients. Now first, let me just caveat here by recognizing that although these tools are incredible and they spit out amazing quality results 
with the right prompting, they also must be thought of as a supplement to what we provide as content creators and video strategists. So take everything that ChatGPT gives you with a grain of salt. Use it to prompt ideas, to get things started and to fill out some context around your ideas, not to replace actual expert human knowledge and insight. So in short, what I'm saying here is don't just copy and paste like I did in the intro to this episode. So I've been playing around with ChatGPT and here are some of the ways that I'm seeing it can be used in video marketing. So first up, and the most obvious is content writing or script writing. You see, tools like ChatGPT can easily and quickly assist with script writing for by generating ideas for your video content. You can provide ChatGPT with some sort of information about your business, the brand, the target audience, and very quickly it, you can ask it to generate some ideas for videos, some topics for videos, and even to write or to create an outline of a script for a video. And it can provide you with different types of videos for different platforms as well. So just by providing it with the right prompt, you can actually generate a whole bunch of ideas. Now, one of the ways that I like using ChatGPT and have been using it over the last couple of months is simply to ask it to first generate ideas. So, you know, maybe ask ChatGPT to, and you might type in as a prompt, I want you to act like a video marketer and come up with 10 ideas for videos around a certain topic, right? And then it'll very quickly spit back a whole bunch of ideas. Now, some of those ideas might be very similar, some of them might not be relevant, but then what I would do is I would ask it to um, you know, create some variations of ideas based on some of the winning ideas that it came up with first. So maybe there's two or three ideas in that list of 10, and then I'll say, you know, take idea number three and four and provide more like that. And very quickly, ChatGPT will spit out more results as well. So then the next stage is you can take that into actually developing an outline for a script. So you could say um, with the following topic and then copy and paste you know, one of the topics that it came up with, with the following topic, please provide or please write a outline for a YouTube video for this script. Now very quickly, it'll come back to you with an outline. And then you can either take that from there and make it your own, or you can further refine the prompts through ChatGPT as well. So for script writing, very powerful. You can even go so far as to copy in, say, an article, uh, maybe it's a full written article or a blog that's been created, and ask ChatGPT to rewrite it as a video script or as a video blog script and it'll take the language used in the in the article which was written more for a written form and then turn it into spoken words for a video very very powerful and it's a great uh, starting point for scripts from that point onwards Another way that you can use ChatGPT and I recommend using it for your video strategy is for video optimization as well. So we know that the importance of optimizing videos both for audiences and for algorithms, uh, regardless of the platform that you're publishing on. So using ChatGPT, you can, it can help you optimize your video content for better engagement by generating relevant tags, titles and descriptions based on your video content. So either transcribe your video um, using any number of video transcription tools such as Otter or, um, or Rev.com for example. And once you've got a transcription of your video, you can paste that transcription in, into ChatGPT as an input and ask it to write a YouTube description based on the content of that video. You can also ask it to suggest a number of um, optimized titles for, for the video as well. And then you can pick and choose which ones work from there. You can even go so far as to ask it to generate some ideas for thumbnails. Now it won't actually create the, the image of the thumbnail, but it will come up with some ideas that you can maybe prompt some thought around the types of thumbnails you might use around that video as well. The next way you might consider using ChatGPT for your video strategy is by doing some audience research. Now recognize that ChatGPT is a, is a programmed language model based on artificial intelligence and information that was fed into ChatGPT prior to 2021. So it's not able to do research for you on current websites and current things like that, but it can provide some insight or analysis of audience behavior. So um, what you can do is you can ask it, give it a, an outline of who your target audience is for any particular video or video strategy, and then ask it to come back to you with some ideas of the types of video content or uh, content ideas and topics that will resonate with that target audience. 
You can even provide it with a, um, you know, some data. If you've got some, some deep data or customer research um, for your brand or your business, then you can paste that content into ChatGPT and ask it to provide some audience analysis about that content. Ask it to say, based on this research, what uh, ideas for videos might you suggest in the future? So it really comes down to there what sort of input you can give as to as far as what sort of result you're going to get back. But I've been playing around with this and I think that there's a lot of potential there for audience research using ChatGPT. Another, another way that you can consider using ChatGPT is to actually generate additional content um, around your long form video content. So by posting, pasting into ChatGPT a, a video script of say a longer, it might be a seminar or a workshop or um, you know a longer form educational type video, you can ask it to generate additional pieces of content from there. So you can ask it to generate a quiz based on the information shared within the video. And it can it will spit out some, you know, maybe a 10 question multiple choice quiz. Or you can ask it to, um, you know, share some some questions that you can ask to check for understanding of the content within the video, or you can ask it to generate a summary of the of the video and um, you know some chapter points based on time codes uh, from from the video. So, a whole bunch of ways that you can actually use ChatGPT to personalize your video content and create additional content off the back of um, your main content as well. Another great way to use ChatGPT is to actually have it assist you with writing voiceover scripts for videos, for example. So maybe it's an explainer video um, or something that's more voiceover driven. Uh, what you can do is actually take a, a more detailed document, um, paste it into ChatGPT and ask it to write a voiceover script uh, which explains it in, in uh, natural language or in simplified terms. You can even uh, instruct it to create variations of that voiceover script and you can say things like writing as if a seven-year-old would be able to understand it or please rewrite this based on um, uh, you know using more sophisticated language or even you could go so far as to say write it in the style of a particular uh, publication so ChatGPT can assist with writing those voiceover scripts and then generating natural sounding voiceover um, scripts that you can then you know, give to a voiceover artist or even use AI voice tools, although some of those are a little bit hit and miss, but you can use some of those AI voice generation tools to actually generate the voiceover for your videos as well. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about a revolutionary way to up your video marketing game. You can even go so far as asking ChatGPT to generate ideas for a video strategy for a business. And obviously this doesn't replace the role of a video strategist, but it can help prompt new ideas that maybe you hadn't thought about before or get the ball rolling on some ideas. So you can ask it simple questions like, um, you know, please suggest types of video content that could be created for X, Y, and Z type business or you can ask it to do competitive research or uh, analysis on a competitor's video strategy and ask it to you know, have a look at a particular other business and uh, you know, come back with the kinds of videos that that business is, is creating and what you can learn from that and, and generate for your own business as well. So plenty of opportunity, I think, for AI tools such as ChatGPT, but it definitely is the early days of artificial intelligence. But what I'm, what I'm seeing and what I'm excited about is I believe it's even now becoming a seriously viable tool that we really need to be um, embracing as content creators and video strategists, um, not rejecting. This really is just the tip of the iceberg. So I've been exploring, for example, AI video creation tools, tools that will actually generate new video content, either from existing content that's put, that's put in as an input, um, that's kind of editing the content um, using AI, or even generating brand new frames of video and animation, um, in much like uh, image generation tools such as Midjourney or even, even Canva has AI image creation now as well. You just type in a text prompt and Canva will come back to you with a brand new image that it's created. Still early days, still a lot that can be done in this space as well. And I believe there is a lot more to come 
for AI. So I'm interested to hear from you. How have you been experimenting with AI tools for your business? Have you experimented or are you playing with ChatGPT? Let me know. I'm very keen to hear either in the comments below this video or hit me up podcast at engagevideomarketing.com and let's start a conversation. And thanks for joining me for this episode of the Engage Video Marketing Podcast. I'll see you in the next episode real soon.